Every year on June the 29th, the city of Rome celebrates its patron saints, St. Peter and St. Paul, a liturgical feast in honor of the martyrdom of the two holy apostles, a martyrdom they suffered in 64 AD when the emperor Nero accused Christians of being responsible for the fire that devastated Rome. The emperor's pretext for this accusation led to a harsh persecution of Christians. Some of them were clothed in the skins of wild animals and eaten by dogs. Others were crucified or even turned into human torches to be lit after dark. And it was in this terrible scenario that Saints Peter and Paul were condemned to death. St. Paul, a Roman citizen, was beheaded. Led in chains under the escort of three soldiers, St. Paul was condemned to death at Aque Salvia, three miles from the city of Rome. Today, the site of the Three Fountains Abbey. The abbey's name comes from the memory of this 13th apostle. According to an ancient tradition, at the moment of his beheading, St. Paul's head fell to the ground and bounced three times, each time giving rise to a spring of water. This is now made visible by three small shrines in the Church of St. Paul at the Three Fountains. The martyrdom suffered by St. Peter was different. According to a well-established tradition, St. Peter did not consider himself worthy to undergo the same death as Christ and had himself crucified upside down. This happened in the vicinity of where St. Peter's Basilica stands today, in the Circus of Caligula. We still have a silent witness of this event, the obelisk that stands in the middle of the square an obelisk that arrived in Rome from Egypt in 40 AD at the command of the Emperor Caligula to be erected in the middle of his circus, which stood to the left of today's St. Peter's Basilica. Only in 1586, under the pontificate of Pope Sixtus V, was this obelisk moved to the center of the square by architect Domenico Fontana. The Feast of Saints Peter and Paul, which originated in the first Christian communities, in memory of their martyrdom and the veneration of the relics of the two apostles, is still solemnly celebrated today. After almost 2,000 years, the city of Rome still pays homage to the saints by laying out carpets of flowers in the small square in front of St. Peter's.